Really, it's my privilege to stand here today, though in a different capacity. Ten years ago, I was standing here at the time trying to make a value proposition for Andhra Pradesh and for Hyderabad. But it continues to be the same spirit we are all Indians and any development in India, we are all happy to support that. I would like to make a brief presentation on what is in store and what at this point the government has thought fit to do in the new state of Andhra Pradesh. As the opening slide shows, we can call it the sunrise state for various reasons. One is, of course, the pure geographical reason that it has a coastline of 4,000 kilometers and sun rises and touches other parts of the country. The second more important reason today, which is valid also, relevant today, is that there is a, a lot of opportunity here. There is a lot of growth, significant growth possibilities in several sectors in this state. So, sunrise is the right word, I thought, that I should use in the first light. And I think history will uh, justify whether I have used this word rightly at this point. Now, the context is that the citizens of the state have high hopes and aspirations there are a lot of needs and opportunities also, as mentioned by some of the speakers earlier, huge opportunities in some of the sectors in the Andhra Pradesh. A lot of potential, a lot of capabilities. But at the same time, we, are, we have to recognize that there are challenges, there are constraints of finance that the new state faces. I guess this we need to work out a strategy that will, you know, produce results. Fortunately, we have a, a very good leadership which has vision also, and it has been proven in the past. 